I'm floating, floating, I'm floating, 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 I'm floating, 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 floating. Yo, what's up, everyone? It's Blue Nova, and I'm here to bring you guys a new tutorial on how to get similar vocal effects to Schoolboy Q and 21 Savage song called Floating off his album Crash Talk. This tutorial is just gonna give you a breakdown on really just how to get the similar quality as him. So if you're new to the channel, make sure to subscribe, hit the bell notification icon if you're new to the channel so you can get reminders every time there's a new video. And also, uh, if you guys want the vocal preset kit for it, you can go to bluenovabeast.com and my raw vocals will be inside so you have something to work with. So let's get into it. What we're gonna do is just go to the master and just turn off what we have. Very simple stuff. And right here on the lead vocal, we're just gonna right click and solo it. And we're just gonna start from the beginning. So the first thing we have is going to be a fruity limiter. And the fruity limiter is just going to level out the vocal so that there's no inconsistent peaks in it. So load in the fruity limiter and click compress right here. Right here on the release, have it straight down the middle, 87.67. In the head, keep that at about 0.52 milliseconds. The knee, turn it all the way to the right. And your ratio, you want to have that at about 2, uh, 201. So threshold, just bring that down until it's at the peak of the vocal. So let's go ahead and play it. File in this transfusion with the drip drop. Sauce everywhere, ain't got broccoli in my ziplock. Tatted on my face, no role model, that's for kids bop. Got it on my waist, let that sh rock on. All right, cool. So after that, we're going to have a fruity parametric EQ too. Now, Schoolboy EQ's vocals in the song Floating, they're not very sharp and they're not really, um, they, they don't really cut with a high end presence. They don't have like a harshness in it. So you want to have something very subtle. So that's why in the, um, around the 14K region, that's where you want to be boosting it at and just boost that to about three decibels and that'll be good enough. For the uh, low frequency, you can see that I cut it up to around uh, 103 hertz just to keep some of that low end frequency because he is rapping low. So you don't want to cut up too high. Uh, with the mid, I, I went ahead and just cut around uh, 183 right here, 278. Um, also right here, 382 and right here, 550. So you just want to drop those all to around like 3.54 decibels. And this is what the vocal will sound like with it. Foul in this transfusion with the drip drop. Sauce everywhere, ain't got broccoli in my ziplock. Tatted on my face, no role model, that's for kids bop. Got it on my waist, let that sh rock on floating. All right, cool. So after that, we're going to have a fruity limiter. Just to go back and even out the vocal, we're going to bring up the gain in here. So you want to have the release, set the all the way down to zero. You can leave your attack in the head alone and just bring the gain up to hitting the ceiling and we drop the ceiling down to negative three foul in this transfusion with the drip drop sauce everywhere ain't got broccoli in my ziplock tatted on my face no role model that's for kids bop got it on my waist let that sh rock on floating all right cool so after that we're going to have spitfish now spitfish is just going to be a free DS that you can get online. You can find it very easily. If you don't have it, then you're missing out. It's very user friendly. So all you want to do, is just turn up the depth right here. Turn it all the way to the right. Right here in the sense, you just want to turn it up a little bit. You don't want to have it too much because it's going to kill out too much of the high frequency in the uh, sibilance in your vocals. And you don't want to do that. Right here in the tune, just leave that at 8K and we're going to play it. File in this transfusion with the drip drop sauce everywhere ain't got broccoli in my ziplock and if we were just to listen to the sibilance in it you have this option right here to turn it on so you can hear it activating right there my face no role model that's for kids bop all right cool now the last thing right here on the vocal chain i just having a fruity reverb too now I noticed that the um, that the instrumental, the piano is a detuned piano, so the frequency, the sound of it sounds pretty wide. Um, so you want to make sure that your reverb is wide, but then you want to make sure that the decay time isn't traveling too long to where it's flooding out the vocal. So with doing that, you want to make sure your stereo separation is all the way to the left. Now you don't want to do this all the time, especially for rap vocals. You don't want too much uh, reverb to where it's too present. Most of the time reverb uh, with stereo imaging, you want to do that for more so singing vocals. But for this one, we just want to have a slight amount and 
And like I said, I compared it as best as I could to uh, Schoolboy Q's vocals. So this is what I found was as close as I could get. Uh, the bass just turned all the way to the right to 100 size of the room, just all the way to 100. Now the high cut right here, you just want to bring it all the way down to 0 0.5. And the wet level right here, you want to have that at 30. The K time, which is important, just how short or this how long or short the decay will go for your reverb and you want to have it short so have that at 1.4 seconds so we're going to go ahead and play it foul in this transfusion with the drip drop sauce everywhere ain't got broccoli in my ziplock tatted on my face no role model that's for kids bop got it on my waist let that sh rock i'm floating all right cool so after that now we're going to work over here with the hook the hook is the important part because when the hook comes in, the vocals double. So what you want to do, uh, the main important thing, you just want to uh, right click, go to file, say mixer track state as, left click and drag it onto any mixer insert that you want and it'll load up. But like I said, if you want everything just hand given to you, go to bluenovabeats.com, presets and everything will be in there inside uh, the folder along with the vocal. So the main difference uh, in here is you want to have a doubler something that's just a, a widener basically so what you want to do is load in the fruity delay too and then click the drop down go to presets then you want to click the preset widen now once you do that this vocal right here is going to sound wider and uh after that what you want to do is roll off a little bit of the low end frequency so you just want to get this band right here the low band and drop it down so that it's not clashing too much with your lead vocal we're just supposed to add as a support to your lead vocal so it doesn't have to be exactly the same you want to trim off a little bit so i'm going to play the highlight vocal by itself Floating, I'm floating, 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 I'm floating, 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 floating. And if I was to take off the uh, widener, the food delay too. Floating, I'm floating, 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 floating. And putting floating, it back on. Floating, I'm floating, 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 floating. So let's go ahead and play that together with the lead. Floating. Floating, I'm floating, 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 I'm floating, 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 floating. Swag on mass, got no less. I'm floating, my turn into a ghost pump. Yes, I'm floating. So, yeah. And the very last thing, just ad libs. Uh, the ad lib right here, I just rolled off the high end frequency because you don't want it to be as sharp and, uh, and present with the lead vocal. You want to make sure the lead vocal is taking care of most of the high end frequency. So you just want to roll off a little bit. Now, this won't apply to every single ad lib or every single song, but this one will work for this specific style. So that's all you really want to do. And after that, you just want to have on a master channel a Fruity Convolver. And I use Maximus, um, not Maximus, I use Ozone 5 Maximizer to act as a limiter on the song. I noticed the frequency in the song, uh, I believe if you look at the original song, you can see that the entire thing looks like it's hard limited. So if it was with a soft clipper, you can kind of see the different peaks. It won't be as full as a block. That's something I've noticed over the years. So that's why I believe was, you know, what is pretty similar to the original song. So I use Ozone 5 Maximizer to do that. If you don't have Ozone 5 Maximizer, I have it on a backup, which will be in a folder. Just load in a Fruity Limiter and just bring the release all the way down to zero. And that should replicate the same style and effect. Now we will play the final quality with the instrumental. And this is what it'll sound like. Start from the beginning and highlight right here. File in this transfusion with the drip drop sauce everywhere ain't got broccoli in my ziplock tatted on my face no role model that's for kids bop got it on my waist let that sh rock i'm floating floating i'm floating 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 i'm floating so yeah that's pretty much how to get the same uh quality as schoolboy q's song featuring 21 savage the uh the only thing I couldn't find the exact instrumental. The piano isn't as uh, accurate as the original song. So I had to use this and get as close as I could with it. But keep in mind that I did compare my vocals back to Schoolboy Q's original song. So this will get you pretty much an exact match to that same song. If you enjoyed this video, go ahead and hit the thumbs up. Put in the comment section what you want to see next. 
if you want your own song mix and master go to bluenovabeats.com go to the contact form on the very bottom and you can send me a message through there and i'll reply to you guys as soon as possible if you need any beats just go to blue nova beats go to the store and find any beats you want and any vocal preset will be available for most artists so thank you guys for watching i'll catch you all on the next video I'm floating, I turn into a ghost pump Yes, I'm floating, floating, I'm floating